when I was under the table, what captured my eye, my eyes captured is the, 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 the picture having a pattern in her legs that I could see the principle. I went to do initiation. When I was in the process of healing, I could not heal fast because when I am alone, I'm still touching myself. I'm the one cooking the chaku, the madaz, the chai, the boshok. The same heart which are cooking, the same heart. I went to do initiation 
when I was in the process of healing, I could not heal fast because when I am alone, I'm still cutting myself. I could not bear imagine having sex with the lady. And this time, the, the picture of the lady, the picture, is still in my mind. Now I'm in secondary school, I've learned how to fall for, still my mind is connected. At one point, I was trying to look for her. Now I was trying to, to, to for her to make the episode continue from where she left me. And tell her, do you know you left me in a danger zone? And you, <laughs> but I could put a hotel in our village, try to, 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 to gather coins to make my family now rise. But still in this hotel, when I am alone in the hotel, I could do some things. I'm the one cooking the charcoal, my dad, the chai, the bosho. The same heart which are cooking, the same heart. And this demon was making sure when I preach in your church, among us to a Christian, Christians in the congregation, would come one lady who will follow me. One of them who follow me. She trusted me, she believed me. So I could handle her in a very special way. But my interest is not the spirituality that she needs from me, not the counsel. After the council, I will put my word, one or two, to take him from spirituality. Mm. I make sure I put you there. Mm. I bring you to me. Mm. Now when you align yourself with what I feel, that we can sex chat, and you are born again, and you could not see a pastor now, to see Paul. We could not see it with you, but I must masturbate, having you in my mind for more times as I can. So many of them, could follow me now, in, who fall in love with me. Mm. They could me, uh, see how I'm careful, I'm calling you, how are you this day? Uh, may God bless you, afternoon, how is your afternoon, evening? Sleep well. Now this concern, because when a lady is con uh, see a man with much concern, this lady could form love with me, with me. But unfortunately, I was not after the body. Though you may find yourself the one among ten, sleeping with her, but the, 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 many of them, I could not have them on bed, but I could masturbate using the pictures. I continued that way, and when I came to realize myself, I was uh, now in a dilemma because I had wasted a lot of opportunity. Now after being paid for, I started working on my, 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 my core, but not my character. I could not even realize my physical life was affected. I could not realize even my, my matrimonial where the marriage is affected. I could see it as a normal thing because nobody knows. Nobody is seeing it. Nobody is judging me. Nobody could accuse me when I was dating because I'm alone. I was thinking that I was eliminating myself from that cue and line and read of those people who are, who are affected by sexual transmitted diseases. Because I'm alone. It's me and my heart. It's my body. Whoever I go to, to confess, after healing me, it will be just a Christmas and throw me away and avoid me. Because he may think I will come to me to defile the church. Even to an extent, one of the ministers where I was sitting in the front row of the church, he could now tell the, 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 the protocol to remove his seat, to take me to the plastic seat in the back. Sex chat with many ladies. So my 
Uh, but one day, she caught me because I bought a phone. And I gave her my phone. Thinking I have visited everything. Without my, my, my private part, which I had sent a credit. So, she knew this is my, my, my husband, private part. So, he could ask me, I've seen something. He said to you, I denied, denied, denied. So, it was out of the confession to my wife that my wife took it in a positive way and told me, I need you. I need a person. I need to judge you. I need to help anybody. But what I will do, I will kneel down and pray to God. After that, I got courage. I got power to realize and feel I must now preach. When now I went to church, that servant of God, who is my best friend, he took me. And he, when I was sitting down in the front chairs, so he walked with me at the back corner of the church. And that man of God may God bless him. And put me in the studio of the church. He went back and yelled. And now he really prophetically. And he said, the cage that he was put to die empty-hearted and to go out of this world without impacting anybody's life, that is the cage that I break today. And as you come from that hall, as you walk to me, I declare you are covered and you are delivered. That is in 2019, now my life started aligning with me of God. Nobody will be able to see you and see any symptom of addiction. Nobody. Nobody will see you and tell you, do you know you are addicted of masturbation? Nobody. Masturbation is a second sin. Only you, God and devil, knows. And the treatment on how to stop this demon is not, not about the empowered water, salt, anointing. Even if we swamp you in the swimming pool of anointing, it may not go if you are not willing to stop. The first step, willingness from your heart. But two, if you're willing to, to stop it, the commitment toward the willingness. You can't tell us you want to stop those sexual immoralities and still you are in the logic. Commitment means you must now close and shut all sites of pornography. Because I was also addicted to watch pornography. I could watch pornography and my wife is on the other side. I'm watching pornography. There was a week I was sleeping at 8 a.m. I entered in the bed at 8 p.m. But I will sleep at 8 a.m. Tomorrow morning, I am plugging my phone with, with the charger in the, in the socket. So the data are there. Because these people, these ladies, want the chat. They want the chat. They, the chat. The video calls. I have the headphones. So nobody is hearing me. So I'm video calling. I may go to the sitting room. I may be naked. She may be naked even the outside the country. So we are doing those rubbishes. And finally, Nafikan has been. And because my mind is occupied, and my Mpesa was because of something, something, some dollars, to maintain the chat and to continue the chat. So I want to go to work. So the demon will make you rest and feel you are comfortable. But two, when you are employed, you cannot be able to be disturbed from 7 a.m. to 4 p.m. to get us. Because this demon is telling you, as you talk about them, go to the toilet. It may bring a man, a handsome man, a very sweet talking man in the hospital. Maybe you are a witness. And finally, if you serve him, the emotions and the feeling come. The demonic feeling, because it is not normal. You go to the toilet, you do whatever you are doing. That is a lady, maybe, you fall in love, whatever you are doing, come back. Other people you see, they are praising God, they are working in the kingdom of services, and you may have never seen them with a man, seen them with a lady. Maybe some people are not married. You fight with themselves, they are satisfying themselves alone. The best environment of this woman is when one fight. Don't give a fuck you in your mind. Don't be that idol to an extent 
that you can take your phone and go to a site of pornography because you can only attract that demon where you when you are idle and doing nothing. So to answer you, during that lockdown time, many people suffered. Many people suffered. And that is was the time that I had hard time myself. Because my family went home. I was left alone. Remember I was delivered. So the demon was to come back with force by that time. I could preach. I was preaching in Facebook. And the reason why I did it, I started that, is because I'm not going to work. Una, una muka, from bedroom to toilet to kitchen to sitting room to the bedroom again. So, so the path is there. When you are now in that level of thinking negative about yourself, the spirit comes to help you to give you company. It helps you to associate. It becomes your associate. My friend, I am here for you. Do this to relax. Watch these things. For the last two plus years, I've been free from that picture. What I have in two and a half years is the things that could have gotten in many years. But it's immediately after stopping the demon and the casting it away and breaking it, I can man I have managed to own my home and to build my family house. I have managed to be very much free and I can have many opportunities that I work with. The spirit owns you. It's only own, it is, does not only own your body, it owns your mind, your finances, your other commitments. You are only committed to do whatever you want. I have a sister in Nairobi and she is a witness, not once, not twice, that her friends would come to my house and after that I follow the those friends. So after chatting, they may tell my sister, is this your brother? Is this the brother we that prayed for us there? Very heavy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, so I told my sister, because you knew my story, and you know where I had gone astray, in the social media, something is posted, my full story, even what you don't know. So, with Ayona, I called my brother, who is a pastor in Nairobi, I told him, I know those are the two who have a smartphone and who can understand. So what I don't know is whether my mother knows. Because my mother is at home, don't know uh, whether my mother in law knows. But many calls are coming to me even through uh, from my, my my pastors, because I, I have joined many many groups of pastors and but many of them I may rebuke. I may rebuke them. And I've rebuked some, some of them. Why? I, because some of them are the ones who rebuked me when they realized I have such an element of this thing. So you can ask, uh, why do you call me to tell me I have wronged myself? What did you do? 2015, we are with you. And when you saw a text in your daughter, in your spiritual daughter's phone, how did you react? Did you t take that thing and you listed it in an announcement? And you know, in the church, and tell the congregation, I'm, I'm a, an immoral person. I'm a very crooked man. Why do you tell me I'm wrong? I am wrong myself, and yet you yourself, you accused me before the congregation. I'm not here to cover up that this was not me, this is another Photoshop. Ah, it is not. It is the little me. Many of us pastors, many people see us as we are angels, but we are men. We have the flesh. We react. We admire, we demand. Our body is like others' body. And anybody can be a servant of God. But being a servant of God, being an anointed man of God, does not mean you're not a human. Don't dare do that, uh, allow that demon to attack you. It will make you poor. It will make you go down. It will crash you to zero. It was, if it had crashed me to zero, I was rejected by money, by society by people, I could search myself to see whether I was rich, but I found I'm not, because I, 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 I had a cast that was self-inflicted.